Hey guys, what's up? Marco here from the Vatican. And today we're going to review this awesome, awesome EVH Series 78 Eruption electric guitar. As always, I have my cat with me. Without further ado, we do like we always do in real time. We take it out of the case and uh, here we go. And there it is. All right. Now that the jokes are over, let's get serious for a second, all right? I don't know what the f uh, Fender and you, uh, Wolfie or Matt, are doing, or uh, and I'm all for it. I mean, listen, we'll get to the second where I wear my uh, capitalist uh, hat, but um, at some point the shit just has to be called out, and since I can afford to do it and I don't care, and I can tell you directly how it is, since I earned my money and didn't inherit it. And nothing wrong with that, by the way. I would have much rather my dad have been Eddie Wolfgang uh, than my father who, you know, was an alcoholic and I had to watch beat up my mom. So make no mistake about that, I'll give you that. But I'm just saying, you're asking $1,900 for an Eruption branded guitar that you don't even have the decency to say Eruption inspired. You're actually trying to sell this to the kids looking straight at their face, telling them that's what the 78 eruption is. And I get it, before you get to the comments and you're like, hey, a real eruption would have cost a 10 grand to make. That's not what I'm on about. Well, actually, you know what? Might as well just put the capital, capitalist hat on in a second. I'll tell you how this works in business. Hey, John, man, how do we milk more of these? Uh, how can we milk the EBH fans more? Well, I'll tell you what, buddy, just put on a freaking another paint, put the same Frankie neck on, they'll do nothing different and call it eruption. These idiots will buy it. And while we're at it, Charging 2100 bucks with tax. Wait a second, does this one actually come with a gig bag? It does, man. This one actually comes with a gig bag at $2,100 made in Mexico, the same price that you can get an Eric Johnson that's made in the USA. Matt, man, I know you do your credit, and Wolfie, I know you're just probably, well, whatever, busy out there playing, and I don't even know who calls the shots, so I don't want to blame you guys for it. Maybe you guys really have no say in it, and Fender does. I've talked enough to Eddie in my life at the gas station and back to the House of Blues, man, when he was really f***ed up, and I was still a waiter there, et cetera, et cetera, back to, you know, just um, a couple of years ago before he died, and those nice messages he was sending to Jen while I was playing at Bar Sinister and vice versa, and, you know, uh, then going to the house and starting the bikes and starting the cars and helping Jen out while, you know, nobody else was to be found. But at some point, the shit becomes so insulting, man, that even I, as a guy who loves selling myself on shit, just, just comes to a point where it's like, why, man? So this is the shit they're trying to uh, sell you for $2,100. It's a solid body basswood guitar, okay? The original was Ash, everybody knows that. So again, for $2,100 with tax to at least use Ash body, you're trying to tell me that the profit margin, you milking it, making this in Mexico, where you're paying people $4 a hour, that you at least don't have the integrity and you matt and wolfie to step up to fender and say hey you know what if you're going to release that at least use the wood that the actual guitar represents that eruption represents no we're going to use basswood even though the original body was ash the original if i remember and i want to make sure i have my facts correct that's correct had a straight 12 inch radius this one has 12 to 16 well i'll tell you why because it's the same neck from the frankie that's exactly what it is the same neck that they're using on the frankie is going on that guitar basically double fisting it it gets better at the original if i remember correctly and again i want to make sure my facts correct i think at 21 frets and i'm going to go here da, 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 yep 21 frets okay let me guess this one has a 12 16 because it's a frankie neck and it is 22 jumbo at least they got the, the fret wire correct because i think the original one had a jumbo too or this is nickel jumbo so you're basically using the wrong woods you're basically using the wrong build you're basically using the wrong finish you're basically using the wrong uh uh fret radius you're using the wrong not even the correct amount of frets and you have the nerve to go on here for a made in mexico guitar at two thousand dollars or more with tax and to put an eruption label on it. I don't care that it's a money grab, but grab all the money you can, but it's an insult. To make it in Mexico, to ask $2,100 with tax and not even have the f courtesy to at least make the, the, the fret count the same. Even you, who's like me, the biggest EVH fan in the world, even you are not that big of a bitch. This is an insult. The, the value to ratio is a bad joke. This is basically the same as a Frankie, repaint a little bit. My review on this, you.